Hello, welcome back to my playthrough of Two Point Campus. And we're going to continue off where we left off on Urban Bungle. And we're going to get our second star. And we're almost there. We got level 13 students done, campus level of 18 done, and a monthly profit of 60,000 done. And just need to get that attractive, attractiveness rating up to 75%. We're at 73. Should hit it. Duck A pool party. Statue. That was cool. And there we go. Urban Bungle, our second star. We got old new point pitcher. Amazingly, your campus is living up to the Bungle standard. Must be quite something to work alongside a mind like Miss Nova's. Which reminds me, could you let her know that my toaster's acting up again? She'll know what it's about. Tarquin Foxbridge. Now, let's see, I got a monthly profit of 80,000. And average student happiness of 75%. And a gray students. It's the Harrison Wolf Show, baby. All right. Harrison Wolf. Oh. Oh. Hey, this is Harrison Wolf, and thanks for stopping by. Today, we're going to be talking about a subject that's near and dear to my heart. The one thing you need when things are getting hairy. You hear something funny outside, or you're just hiding from the milkman. The that's milkman. Right. Today, we're talking panic rooms. Panic rooms. Do 
Let's see, who else will train you in medical first aid? There we go, we got that average student happiness of 75%. Monthly profit of 80,000. Academic inspection. Campus facilities. by plot number seven. Every good panic room starts with its supplies. Now some things are a must. You should probably your maybe a little you bottles of water, sure. But don't be afraid to show some personality. I for one keep a bowling ball in my panic room. I find it's the perfect place to practice. Get three people start training to should try moving faster. One student is very unhappy and refusing to pay their fees. This is expanding. Do do 
Surveillance. I'm strictly an surveillance kind of guy. My philosophy is I can't see you, you can't see me. So I like to keep things as low tech as possible. I'd recommend strategically placed strings attached to some bells. You hear a ring, and you got yourself a visitor. Of course, sometimes it's the doorbell, and you really do have a visitor. If you want to get real crafty, just leave a load of rakes in your yard. No one suspects a rake in the yard. But a rake in the yard. Steps on one and takes a handle to the chops. The Ouch. chops. By the last plot, number ten. Janitor Whoa. In computer lab. Janitor required in computer lab. At 29 students graduate with A plus, year 11.
We won Campus of the Year and Queen of Clubs. What am I going to do with my life? I just what am I going know. to do? Oh, or what? Come to an old foundation learning center and replace your mind foundation. with the power of the orb. Oh, amazing! I'll do that then. Thanks. Taking students for virtual normality. A question from Gyro and Duckworth. Duckworth. What are some of your favorite panic room pastimes? Well, thanks for the question, Gyro. I find that you can have a lot of fun with a little bouncy ball. Bouncy fact, ball. One time I was bouncing, lost track of time, and it turned out that I've been doing it for 16 hours. I went cold turkey after that, meaning I was hungry, and took a turkey sandwich out of the freezer. Turkey. Cheesy gubbins.
one to the more advanced panickers amongst you. It's important to be one step ahead. What do I mean by that? Well, you could do a number of things. You could have a trap door for sneaky getaway. You could install your panic room in a hall of mirrors. Or you could hang a sign on the door that says, out for lunch. <laughs> they won't know what's hidden.
Let's take one more question before we wrap up here. Hmm, here's a good one. What type of wood would you recommend for the furniture in your panic room? Well, panic you room wrong with oak. That baby's a classic for a reason. Me, personally, I like a maple. It's heavy, and I like the added water resistance. Plus, it's fun to say. Maple. Maple. Janitor needed to unlock toilets. Lovely. Bom, bom, bom. Believe that smell is you. Meet Wizard. to build your brand new panic rooms. Don't panic take room. our radio so Harrison can come along for the ride. Now, I, I know what you're thinking, but Harrison, can't they track me with the frequencies? And the answer is probably yes, but the Harrison Wool Show is worth the risk. Happy hiding, listeners. Harrison Wolf. Yeah. 
Year number 12. Contribution to research. Rising staff. Cutting edge campus. Campus of the year. And Queen of Clubs. Anyways, I think this is a good place to stop. If you like the video, leave a comment, give it a like, comment, subscribe, and this is Samurai Tacos signing off. Have a good one. Bye-bye.